Hey guys, welcome to Blue Note and Blue Note is about time listening to messages. So if these messages resonate with you, like, share, subscribe. Today's date is August 26, 2022. The song is the song I got in my head is um I wonder if I take you home, would you still be in my baby? Because I need you tonight. I don't know who sang that song. It just popped up in my head. It's actually something that I just would not listen to. Not saying it's, it's not a bad song, but I'm just like curious on why that song came up in my head. I'm getting this energy like somebody wants to probably be free. Maybe um probably want to take somebody home. Whatever. However it resonates, it resonates, okay? But um <clears throat> your overall energy, you have mature man. Clarify with the moon followed by the three of cups. So this mature man, this mature man number five, this is somebody who could be as a teacher or guru or a spiritual guru. This could be the Hierophant, Taurus, Gemini energy. Somebody is definitely being very wise about something. They're, they're making a wise decision, okay? Clarify with this moon card. Somebody is being very wise into using their intuition about something, okay? Um, somebody is definitely seeing something. They're definitely watching and seeing something. They, they're trying to see some type of some type of truthness here somebody is trying to definitely see what's going on probably with a third party somebody is using their intuition about a third party who's probably giving them some type of illusion okay they are definitely seeing a secret about a third party this is a third party who is probably very deceptive they um they give off some type of illusion Okay, something is not what it appears to be with a third party. There are some type of hidden elements here. Okay, somebody is probably discovering also that somebody is definitely, a third party is definitely delusional. This could be somebody who they probably had, um, they probably partied with a lot or you or somebody else probably partied with a lot. Somebody who they probably had a lot of... Um, gatherings with or or they probably was drinking with this person they probably had happy times or fun times with this person but i feel like somebody is realizing that somebody is probably either delusional or they're really deceptive or they backstabbed them in some type of way so i feel like somebody is definitely setting some type of boundaries with this person this could be somebody that you probably had a sexual relationship with maybe three sums or you're probably looking at three other three or four different people that you are seeing that is definitely giving you some type of illusion okay because something is definitely not what appears to be there's definitely some type of hidden elements here okay i feel like somebody is looking at something in a different perspective they're like really plotting to find out some type of secrets okay um whoever this mature man is this could be you or this could be somebody else taurus gemini energy pisces cancer energy um this is somebody who's being very patient right now because they're looking at things at another perspective they like looking at things in step by step it's like everything is coming up i'm seeing a can of worms okay i feel like they're balancing their stuff out. i also think somebody is trying to they're this this person is trying to plot they're they're trying to find out some type of secrets about this third party because I feel like somebody is definitely trying to plan some type of grand escape as well. Somebody definitely is trying to escape. They're really pro processing something. There is some type of progress that they have to go through step by step to look at things in different perspectives about this person because they know that this person is a liar. Okay, um, this is definitely somebody who they're going to be setting boundaries with or they're communicating that they're setting boundaries with this person. They're going to be expressing to this person that they're setting boundaries with this person because somebody is definitely planning some type of escape here. You got change here. Okay. Somebody's uh, this uh, mature man, he's definitely getting into his introspection. Okay. Um, 
somebody got a spiritual enlightenment or they had an awakening i just did a reading yesterday about somebody who had an awakening or an enlightenment okay this mature man is definitely in his hierophant position okay he has a lot of authority he's a head person in charge i feel like he has i feel like he is seeing something okay he's 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 getting into his introspection he is in self-reflection mode he's going deep within he's working on himself and i feel like he is hiding that he's going through a cycle change okay somebody also could be moving or relocating but there's definitely some type of shift here and i feel like whatever the shift is is going to solve some type of problem here because i feel like somebody has found out about some type of deception or some type of backstabbing bullshit that's been going on and also finding out that somebody gave them some type of illusion okay and whoever this person is that gave them some type of illusion is definitely delusional and i feel like this mature man is realizing this okay somebody they're probably also realizing that somebody is doing a third party is doing some type of magic this could be bonding magic. This could be um, financial magic. This could be some type of spell that this person is is um, putting on this mature man. Somebody is realizing something. So they're like on and off in their energy. You could be on and off in energy. Very fickle in this energy, okay? Um, being as though you're in this energy, you are definitely going through some type of cycle change or some type of sh shift. Um, you're actually acting aloof right now i feel like you're focusing on your finances right now um definitely taking a step forward to leave old familiar situations because i feel like you have found out some type of backstabbing or deception here somebody you found out some type of secret so you're definitely taking a step forward to leave old familiar situation you are literally planning your grand escape okay you're escaping from a low vibrational situation or you're just you're just moving on and letting go to get some type of peace i'm strongly getting peace energy okay i feel like you and this energy are running away but i feel like you are escaping also because i feel like you are i feel like you're just worried about your finances right now i feel like this is justice for you to actually get away 10 11 is very significant this is definitely justice for you i also feel like you're probably getting away because i feel like you with this lover's card you got lover's courtship and you have occupation i feel like you are you are leaving old familiar situations because i feel like you may be in love with someone else who you're trying to court this could be a businesswoman okay this could just simply be you actually planning your grand escape to worry about your stability and probably start a new business or start ha have a new beginning but i strongly feel like you are in love you're addicted and obsessed with someone this is somebody who you are making a decision from the heart. This is somebody who you are devoted to. You are, you adore this person. This is like an authentic love. There is some type of attachment here, okay? Some type of closeness with somebody who you are trying to court. This is somebody who you are in love with. Somebody who you want to have a new beginning with, okay? You are determined to have victory and success with this person. This could be a business owner. This could be somebody who is following their calling. Or this could be you that's actually addicted and obsessed with moving forward and having a new beginning in love, okay? Um, I feel like whoever this business owner is, what time is it? Because I feel like, okay, eight. Whoever this business owner is, I feel like you, this person is very confident. I feel like this is somebody who stays true to their self. And I feel like you got a reality check that you are in love with this person. This is so similar to my last blue note that I just did, okay? Somebody know, somebody is, somebody got a reality check that this is real love. This is an attachment, a real love. This is definitely something that you are definitely loyal to. This is a loving experience that you probably never really had before or you never actually acknowledged about this person this is somebody who probably is, they probably got a lot of respect in the community okay this is somebody who is upgrading in a community whoever this business owner is this could be you or this could be somebody else who you are in love with I, this is definitely some lover situation you could be dealing with um somebody who you want a renewal with you want to heal this connection with this person this is definitely somebody who you look at as a star or a muse. You look at them as your piece. You want to give them a gift. Because I feel like you definitely made a decision about this person with this courthouse here. 
and oh you got courthouse and you got adjudication you definitely made a decision about this person you you may have been taking lessons from this person or you learned some type of lesson with this person but i definitely feel like with this courthouse and adjudication you definitely want to communicate with this person but there's some type of conflict or challenges i feel like this person challenge you and i feel like you are analyzing that this person is challenging you but you are definitely making a debate about this person and a debate is definitely something about you realizing that this is real love okay i feel like you are manifesting this person okay okay but yeah i feel like you are planning some type of grand escape because you are learning some type of secret about a third party you also are planning to have some type of reunion with a high priestess okay this is somebody who is your wish fulfillment Planning a reunion with a high priestess. This is definitely somebody who is probably a psychic or a tarot card reader. Somebody who is very spiritually high ranked. Some who this person definitely have a lot of knowledge and wisdom. They use their intuition. This is somebody who really knows what's actually going on. This is your wish fulfillment. This is somebody who you are having this loving experience about. You realizing that this is real love. This is the person that's following their calling. Okay. You are realizing that she, this person, uh, I feel like this person, their self, I feel like they're eating good. I feel like they are getting fame and achievements. They're happy. Um, I feel like they're very humble, very grateful. This is somebody who is your dream, okay? Wish fulfillment. You feel, you feel like you can get success and rewards with this person. Whoever this is, this is somebody who really takes care of their self, okay? But you got this full card in reverse and then you have the four of cups. I feel like you feel like this is risky right now. I feel like you're being foolish in this behavior, okay? This could end up in a missed opportunity, okay? I feel like you are being reckless in this energy. Really kind of like distracting yourself. I feel like you are contemplating whether you want to talk to this person or not. You're being stagnant towards this person. You may be being stagnant, blocking off your emotions it could be just you just not really wanting to take that step forward and be in a relationship but i feel like you're like daydreaming about this person i feel like you are still in your shadow side but i feel like you know intuitively that this is this is somebody who is your wish fulfillment but you're blocking off your emotions with this emperor card you're upright so i feel like you're in a good position right now i feel like you are very stable probably being very logical about your approach being protective in your energy I feel like you're just dictating everything and looking at everything in different perspective, okay? You're really procrastinating. And I really think it has a lot to do with your freedom. I feel like you like to be free. You're on a passionate pursuit, but I feel like you're blocking off your emotions, okay? Yeah, this is really kind of like conflicting type of energy. You're upright, though. You're upright, but you're, you're a knight in reverse and you're on a passionate pursuit. There is a Queen of Cups in reverse that's um, probably smothering you right now. This is somebody who's really insecure. They're feeling out in the cold. They're feeling unloved. This is somebody who probably is not really authentically their self. Yeah, whoever this is, is somebody who's probably like an overbearing baby, baby mama. This could just be that third party that you're definitely leaving behind or realizing the secrets about. This person is really depressed. Okay. Mm, this is somebody who is really smothering you. Very insecure, okay? Whoever this is, this is somebody who's really emotionally immature. This is that third party that you're leaving behind. This person is smothering you. They know that you are moving towards somebody else, so I feel like they're really bitter and very spiteful right now. This is somebody who really has a blocked intuition. This is, um, there is no love in this situation. There is no growth in this situation. This person really is just like, they don't really have inner peace within their self. Um, I feel like this person wants a renewal with you, but I feel like there this is like a situation where it's going to be like, if you get with this person, you're going to get nothing but bad luck with this person. You got the will of fortune in reverse. There's definitely some type of setbacks and delays in that situation because you're blocking off your intuition with this person. You do not want a commitment with this person, Okay. I feel like this person is somebody who you probably can do whatever you want with this person. I feel like you don't plan on being with this person at all. 
this is somebody who you do not want a commitment with or you just do not want to be in a commitment right now okay you could do you you want to do what you want to do you want to be a player you want to do whatever you want to do right now you're blocking off your emotions but i feel like you already want a reunion with somebody else but you're definitely blocking off your emotions. You're being stubborn. I feel like you being a trickster right now. I feel like you just want to be free and uncomfort. I don't feel like you want to be bothered with any type of relationships right now. I feel like you are very stable right now. You could be the patriarch of the family. You could be a father figure. I feel like you just worried about yourself right now. Okay? I feel like you're being very disciplined, being very practical right now. I feel like your stability is up to par. And I feel like you just want to be by yourself right now. But your eyes is really set on this high priestess, your wish fulfillment. But right now, I feel like you just feel like it's risky right now. You're probably trying to continue to keep yourself occupied to get yourself together. But I feel like right now, you, you definitely is really focused and concentrated right now. You could be just focused and concentrating and working on yourself. What are you focused and concentrating on? You're focused and concentrating on getting out of a situation that's making you feel burdened and stressed or feeling trapped in some type of way. And that could be that third party situation, okay? Yeah, you, you're breaking it off with a third party here. There is a breakup or a separation here. You do not want to be with a third party, okay? And whoever this third party is, this is definitely somebody who probably is doing some type of magic because they're jealous, okay? Gemini energy. Yeah, for sure, okay? I feel like at the present time, you, your third eye is completely open, okay? You're in this energy of probably a little worried and concerned. I feel like you're not really concentrating right now. I feel like you may have... Um, you have discovered the secret about this third party and I feel like you may have realized that you was unaware, un, unaware, unaware of who this person really is. Okay. Um, you probably misjudged or misunderstood or there was some type of misunderstanding whereas though you didn't have clarity about who this person really is, okay? I feel like you made a mistake and I feel like you're a little worried and depressed right now about this person, okay? But your third eye is completely open. Clarify with this king of swords, the her hermit in reverse and the queen of coins, okay? I feel like you a little worried and concerned so I feel like you kind of like um, a little detached and rigid right now, okay? And I feel like you add them in and set on staying disciplined and losing, using your logic right now, okay? You are ghosting this queen of coins in reverse. This could be a mother figure. This could be that queen of cups in reverse, that in, that in prison reverse. This could be a mother figure or this could be a baby mama, okay? I feel like you are withdrawing from this person. You're blocking this person because I feel like you're reevaluating something. If this has a lot to do with children or child support, I feel like you are really um, worried about probably a lawyer or you're probably really worried about... Um, you having to call a lawyer or get a lawyer or something about a lawyer i feel like you definitely um is trying to organize some type of situation i feel like you're reevaluating who the fuck this person is this could be a baby mama or this could just be a third party who's trying to get you for your money okay i feel like this person is doing magic and i feel like they're trying to do magic on your wealth but i feel like your third eye is definitely open about this person okay some secrets is definitely being revealed about who this person is to you and i feel like you're plotting and planning your grand escape i feel like whatever ideas that you have i feel like you are definitely at them and set in this situation okay I feel like you are really intelligent, very logical. I feel like you are disciplining yourself. And I feel like right now you're staying cool right now, but I feel like you're demanding respect. If you are a father figure and, I, and um, dealing with a baby mama who's trying to take you for child support or something or a divorce, I feel like you are. it's, it's going to come in your favor. I feel like you're being very smart about your approach here. And I feel like you're doing a good job right now. I feel like... um. Right now, I feel like you're blocking off your emotions. You're being very defensive in this energy, but I feel also you're do you're you're like this because I feel like you're taking the blindfold off. Okay, you're being a stalemate because you know that this person is. You you know that 
you know that this person is full of bullshit. I feel like you already are seeing you're you were unaware of what the fuck was going on because I feel like you was not paying attention about who this person really was. I feel like it has a lot to do with your ignorance that maybe from the past you may not have been aware, you may have had a blocked intuition, but I feel like your third eye is completely open right now and I feel like you are definitely um being very logical about this approach so i feel like you're taking a blindfold about this person and you're refusing to com compromise with this person whatever they're trying to do because i feel like you're really tired of this fucking energy okay you're really fucking tired of it and i feel like you're really adamant and set and being rigid and stubborn towards this person this queen of cups in reverse you're blocking off this person okay refusing to compromise just and, it, and honestly i feel like you're walking around with a chip on your shoulder i feel like whatever you have found out about this person i feel like it's three other people involved i feel like you're getting rid of three other people but one of these people could be a baby mama and I feel like you are seeing a truth about who this person is, okay? I feel like you um still walking around with a chip on your shoulder because I feel like you're still angry that you might have gotten played. Or I feel like you're just tired of this person's energy. And I feel like you and this energy are protecting yourself, but you're in this king of swords, this king of swords energy, okay? And it's probably because you're like a little control freak. I feel like this situation is really stressing you out. I feel like you need in solitude because whoever this is, is really like attacking you in some type of way. I'm feeling a, a attack. Whereas though you feel like you need to really re regroup yourself, rest, meditate, relax. You're probably in your introspection right now. I feel like you just really going through a spiritual enlightenment because of this. I'm feeling a sting right now. I feel my root chakra is tingling, but it's not, it's, it's. It's like a annoyance here, okay? This queen of coins is, is probably a baby mama, maybe a mother figure, but I feel like you may have had some type of collaborations with this person, but right now I feel like you're protecting yourself and you're expressing yourself towards this person. You do not want to talk to this person, okay? You definitely want to, you feel like this is a good time to actually escape from this situation, okay? I feel like, um... Yeah, you learning some type of secrets about these third parties, for sure. Yeah, I feel like you are learning the truth about who this is. This third party could be a Cancer, Virgo. Yeah, this person had you under some type of illusions. They have a whole bunch of secrets. I feel like you're setting boundaries with this person. Something is definitely not what it appears to be with this person. This person is probably somebody who probably shows off like they have this and that, but they really broke. And I feel like you, you are definitely in this energy of realizing how much of a mistake you made by even dealing with this person or collaborating in this with this person in any type of way okay yeah whoever this is if they're doing something very spiteful they're doing this out of jealousy this is somebody who is really jealous this is a jealous third party they're jealous that you are actually escaping and moving on they're jealous that you are healing yourself they're jealous that you are progressing they don't want you to progress without them okay yeah for sure. Let me see. I feel like you're just more interested in balancing yourself out. You're more interested in your peace. I feel like you are not compromising in this situation with this person. Uh, I just feel like you know that this person is probably being vindictive. You are definitely refusing to offer from this person. Um, the letters that I got in this reading is B-K-T-I-R-H-Q-Z and F-O-X, okay? I just strongly feel like you do not trust this person at all. It's a whole bunch of conflict in a situation. There's no love in a situation. I feel like you are completely detaching yourself from anybody who has a whole bunch of secrets and lies. They're setting boundaries. You know that these people are very deceptive and they're backstabbers. I feel like you just feel like these people gave you a whole bunch of illusions and whoever these third parties is they're very delusional and i feel like you are seeing that you got the mature man and you have the moon it's either you are delusional or you're realizing that these people have secrets and they're delusional okay but i feel like you're strongly using your intuition and i feel like you're going through a shift or a change 
Um, you may be hiding that you're probably relocating or I just feel like you're just on a journey right now and I feel like these people are not going to make it, okay? I'm going to pull from the Rebel deck, okay? Because this is like... Let's pull some fun into this situation. I feel like you just reevaluating and you are really planning a grand escape for your happiness and wish fulfillment okay give zero fucks honestly I, I just feel like you need to be in that energy these people are really just trying to hold you guys back give you some type of illusion i'm strongly getting an illusion somebody is trying to give you a story or they tried to give you some type of story and the shit ain't fucking working Taurus, Gemini, Cancer, Pisces energy, um, Virgo energy, strong Gemini, Virgo energy, Leo energy. And yeah, this is like some bullshit here. And I feel like you kind of calm. I feel like you're being really cool in this energy. I feel like you still demanding respect from these people but you really don't want to fuck with these people you really are detached and i feel like you're adamant and set and making that decision about leaving these people behind and i really feel like you still want to have a new beginning somewhere else this could be business i feel like your heart chakra is definitely open towards another path i didn't get a new path card but i feel like you are definitely on this journey of going on another pathway and i feel like the other pathway has nothing to do with these third parties because these third parties are full of deception and backstabbing that's all they worry about is actually backstabbing you or getting something out of you okay yeah i feel like you are i feel like you have enough information to know what the fuck is going on here okay because it's looking like you are the good guy here and i feel like the good guy actually is really concerned because they really made a mistake about a mother figure or a third party or a baby mama situation somebody chose somebody who wasn't good for them or somebody is just realizing that these people are just not good for them for their future okay there's no love in a situation. There's trust issues. You do not trust these people. There's a whole bunch of conflict and challenges here. Um, there's a detachment. You're not in a relationship with these these people. You do not want to be in a relationship with these people. Um, it's like a love affair that's actually over, okay? Yeah. More... bottom of the deck is have you eaten have you eaten you are acting like a big ass baby i mean you need food in your belly eat a fucking taco tacos may be your favorite food um you're a grown ass adult stop blaming others for your shit it's not everyone else's fault it's yours okay so i feel like you probably just not really i feel like you just looking at the situation like i'm really fucking concerned because i really made a mistake of actually choosing this person to be in my life this is why you're really concerned um i feel like you as a grown-ass person you need to stop blaming others for actually your choices you made a choice with being with this person i feel like right now you're really reevaluating who you were actually dealing with somebody is showing that they're the queen of pentacles well, I say queen, queen of pentacles, queen of coins, but they really like somebody who is very jealous, very conniving. And I feel like you are really seeing the truth about this person. This person is full of deception and lies, okay? You tight ass, loosen the fuck up, control freaks, don't get laid. Yeah. Loosen the fuck up, control freaks, don't get laid. I'm sorry about that. Yeah. This is you, King of Swords. I feel like you are a control freak, but I feel like you are in this control freak type of energy for a reason, okay? You need a fucking, you need a, a big fucking hug, squeeze. Somebody definitely, I'm getting a song. I wonder if I take you home, would you still be in my baby? So I feel like you may be having one night stands with people or you really just trying to get some attention from other people, okay? 
Too much screen time is making you awkward and sad. Go talk to a, a live person. Put the fucking phone down. So I feel like you probably just need a break from actually being online. If you are waiting for a sign, well, here the fuck it is. What the hell are you waiting for? Get that shit done. So if this has a lot to do with you actually going to court, or getting a lawyer i feel like you need to hone in on that okay i don't know what you're actually waiting for in that situation okay what time is it 29 i feel like we in good timing here that's cool though yeah i feel like you're walking away you're walking away from the situation okay you may be drinking a lot um you may be realizing that these secrets is coming out you realizing that you're, you're unveiling some secrets about third parties you're unveiling secrets about people who you may have had kids with mother figure third party somebody who you probably just probably gave money to or had to pull out a lot of money yeah this is the truth you're walking away you have clarity you got a reality check that this is the truth that this is what you want to do you want to escape okay you want to escape you're planning a grand escape for happiness and wish fulfillment and that's just what it is i'm going to pull a meditation quote for you guys be kind and full of love but have boundaries like a motherfucker okay this is you planning your grand escape just being very calm and cool about it but definitely setting boundaries with this third party okay and if you are having a reunion with a high priestess this high priestess already know this high priestess already know what's actually going on she already know about the affairs she got shit figured out this is somebody who's very spiritually high ranked okay this is also somebody who probably sets a lot of boundaries okay but i hope this is very helpful for you guys again this is blue note time is not a messages so if these messages resonate with you like share subscribe um today's day is august 26 2022 um it's looking like you already got this shit figured out but this is basically just confirmation for you okay if you're waiting for a sign get the shit done here it is but i love you guys Mochas.